China's autonomous region, Tibet, has been found at the forefront of the country's efforts to promote green development. China has made remarkable advancement in the conservation of the ecosystem over the past five years. This report has more details. China has stepped up protection of Tibet's natural resources, such as grasslands, wetlands and forests. In Lhasa City, the area of water bodies in the Lalu Wetland National Nature Reserve has been expanded around 30%. This increased the number of migratory birds to over 15,000. The efforts resulted in the steady growth of Yunha up nosed monkey, a severely endangered species. The steps to protect the ecosystem have greatly improved people's well-being. We have felt continued improvement in the sanitation, ecology and infrastructure in the Lalu Wetland Reserve whenever we come for a walk and fresh air. The environment is better and our sense of happiness is stronger. The reserve is also home to other animals such as clouded leopard, snow leopard and wild ox. On the whole, some 440 kinds of vascular plants and nearly 160 types of vertebrates have been found in the reserve. In the past five years, Laza has achieved a green transformation through afforestation and management of its water resources. We've connected the Potala Palace and the Norbulinka Palace to World Cultural Heritage Sites through the expansion of our river system, which covers a combined 72.24 kilometers with the newly added 36 kilometer long water bodies, measuring 26 hectares in total. In Tibet, a total of 538,800 square kilometers in 74 counties and districts have been designated for ecological conservation. It has also built 47 nature reserves of various types with a combined area of 412,200 square kilometers. The Chinese authorities have invested about 9 million US dollars to improve in 